not believe what I just found. It's a Queen Anne. But one so rare, I can't believe it exists, let alone that I found it. This queen is called Perona Mermet, and like many uncommon ants, it doesn't have a common name. It's known from only five specimens ever, with no previous queens, let alone alive, making it one of the rarest ants in the world. And now we begin this journey, raising it from scratch, and using a completely normal test tube setup with some sterile sand. And if she manages to found successfully here, then this is proof you need no special gear to keep ants. I fed her a baby cricket, which she seemed interested in, but didn't visibly eat, at least not when I was watching. I also gave her a cotton ball with some honey water to drink. Finally, the setup was ready. But I was worried. What if I failed? What if I ruined everything? There's almost no information on these ants, so I had no idea how to cater for her. Well, there was only one way to go on. It was time to begin. They're supposed to be nocturnal and arboreal, although I found mine walking around on the ground in the middle of the day. A colony of this genus has never been found, even though scientists have actually searched for it. And this might mean it's just good at hiding, or lives really deep underground. But it might also mean it's even rarer than the dinosaur ant. This queen was new to science, emerging on the horizon of my ant keeping journey. And I knew there was only one way I could describe that. Welcome to the colony, Dawn. <laughs> 